Time now for the Sports Zone. It is week one of the big dance, and we'll preview some WVU hoops later in tonight's show. But first, a high school hoops classic kicked off today, the Parmar Shootout, and it's being held at West Virginia State. We'll start with the Lady Patriots taking on Winfield. Now, this name you probably already know, Calissa Lacey at the top of the arc. She kicks it inside. Some quick ball movement right there and back to Lacey who makes that three look easy. Winfield with it now. A toss to Taylor. She fakes outside and takes it all the way in for two. A great shot, but unfortunately it would be G-Dub's ball game tonight. Vivian, Vivian Ho here with the rebound and tosses it down the court to Lacey who gets that easy bucket the Patriots dominating this one the final 65 to 30. And earlier tonight, we had an unbeaten South Charleston trying to take down four and one Morgantown. Fourth quarter here, South Charleston down by 11. Barrett Johnson knocks down the jumper. It's a 13 point lead for Morgantown. Next possession, a toss down the court and to Morgantown's Lindsey Betchel, who gets the easy bucket now 46 to 34. South Charleston still trying to come up from behind and unfortunately for South Charleston, it's too little too late. Sydney Harris gets the contested basket late and this one was all Morgantown today. The Mohegans take down the Black Eagles 52 to 38 the final. And to the boys now, Charleston Catholic taking on St. Mary's. First quarter here, a pass to Aiden Satterfield, and Satterfield good on the step back jumper right there. CC on top here by a score, and Satterfield would not be done there. In transition, he tosses it to Zion Suddeth, who drives and gives Charleston a 13-10 advantage. Later on, J.P. McCutcheon drills a three right here. Just beautiful. And this would be a tighter game, but the Irish stay strong and come out with the win. The score 57 to 42, the final.